Last night I had some gelatin left over so I put it in a tiny pot and I just reheated it up and I'm going to use that today. With a fairly small paintbrush I'm just drawing a line onto my skin whilst pulling the skin taut with my fingers. To help let that dry I'm just going to use a hairdryer on a cool setting. Once that's dry just repeat until you're happy with how the scar is looking. As a makeup artist I would normally use something like a rigid collodion or two plus to create scars but this is a really good cheap and quick alternative. So doing a scar on my lip just to show you the different places that you can do this. Remember to pull the skin really tight when it's drying. I then do a little bit of white with a white eyeliner and around the scar I do a bit of red lip liner. When you remove the gelatin it's always best to just get it wet with a damp cloth and remove it that way rather than pulling at it, especially around hairy areas. I like to reference from pictures of real scars and wounds. Some scars go into the skin whereas some tend to be raised so it's entirely up to you what kind of scar you'd like to do. The gelatin gives a nice shine to the look of the scar which if you've had one then you'll see that they do have a little bit of a shine to them.